Yes, peeps. All right. First thing we're going to do, we're going to download the Sans Home app and um, ensure that we're on the same network as the DVR on the phone. So we are going to register and log in. Then you're going to select the plus sign at the top right hand corner and then you're going to select manual adding. After we select that, this menu now we're going to go back to the DVR to input these information. So we're going to go to settings on the DVR, network and general and um, the IP address you see you're going to input it there. Put in the IP address, all right, and then you're going to put in the same login you use to log into your DVR. So you're going to put in the password, the same password, and the same username right here. All right, <clears throat> all right, then you're going to see your cameras come up. After these cameras come up, you can only view them while you're on the same network. So now we want to want to be able to change that so we can see them while we're on another net network somewhere else so we are now going to generate a code so we are going to go to more and then we're going to go to settings and then we're going to, we're going to generate a qr code right so now you're going to go to your phone settings you're going to find where your files are on your phone mine is on samsung and then my file and then um, internal storage after we go to internal storage on my phone you're going to go um, to DCIM that's where your pictures are you're going to look you're going to see sans home going to sans home you should see a barcode generated there you're going to go to select the barcode then you're going to go to the the dot at the top right hand corner and go on to detail to get the code after you see device, you're going to see um, the code. So you're going to select, put in these codes. So you're going to go back now to the DVR network and then um, Sans Home and input that code there. You should see two barcode comes up after you input it and it should be online. Next, you're going to do it again. You're going to select the plus sign, but this time you're going to scan the barcode the one on the right so you're gonna scan that barcode it should be online now so you're gonna scan that barcode and you should be okay